On this kid safari, we go to the Griffith Observatory. It's an amazing place in Los Angeles, California. What does it say, Steli? Oh, Hollywood! That's right. You can get there by driving, but the parking was really tough, so we took a hike. It was kind of a long hike, up a steep hill, but it was a really nice hike. Hey, Zaley, are we hiking? No. No? Yes, we are. Do you know where we're going, Lila? All the way up there to the big telescope looking thingy. We got good sunshine, amazing views, and we even saw some wildlife. Eventually we got to the observatory. This is the sun. Can you believe Mercury is that far from the sun? And Venus is this far. And the Earth is this far. And Mars is this far. It does, does it go to more? It does, look. Then out here is Jupiter from the sun over there. What's next, Deli? Saturn. Saturn. Wow, look how far back we have to go. There's Uranus. Does it keep going? Okay. That is really far. We found Neptune and Pluto, and their orbits actually cross. And there's so much to explore. Let's go into the elevator. Switch them up so oh. Wait till you get in here, Lai. Oh, cool. Amazing things all about astronomy. There's even a meteor simulator, and that was my favorite part. Okay, so that's water. It could get in the water. Or there's igneous metamorphic rocks. Water. Okay, water. Okay, now, end number three today. Let's watch it. Total destruction of Earth. Oh, geez. Well, it was a thousand mile, very Mother. dense, sorry, thousand kilometer, very dense asteroid. Wow. Silly, look, this is an iron meteorite. Whoa. The place is named after, after Griffith J. Griffith, who really loved astronomy. And not only did he give Griffith Park to LA, but he gave the observatory for the public. The construction began in the 1930s, and it's just been getting better and better ever since. Silly, you know why it looks like this? Because it's made of gas. And so it spins differently in the middle. Look, Selen, look. Look how it spins differently in the middle than it does at the top. See that? Keep spinning it. And the middle looks a little bit different from how it spins at the top. And that's how it's spinning on Whoa. Jupiter. This room allows you to explore things about every planet. All right, this says to the telescope. Some areas were closed off due to coronavirus. Wow, look at the so we couldn't look through that telescope, but there are plenty of other things to see and do. As we swing back toward home, we see that the stars and galaxies in the big picture lie along a three-dimensional corridor of space.
allowed to watch a movie. It wasn't Star Trek, but it was starring Leonard Nimoy. And next to an amazing view of the LA Basin, we ate our lunch before exploring some more. This big pendulum shows you how the world is actually rotating. And before we left, we had to hit the gift shop because they had some cool stuff there. It's so fun to learn about space and the technology that astronomers use. So always stay curious. Explore your world, even if it goes out to the stars. Thanks for watching this kid's safari. Be sure to like and subscribe and share our videos to inspire others to explore their world.